As we know, the Canada-Sri Lanka relationship uh, is a long and historical one, over 60 years. It's a relationship that has been continually strengthened by the contributions of uh, Sri Lankan communities and diaspora in Canada. And the value of this is demonstrated um, by the visit uh, by uh, Minister Dion Foreign Affairs uh, in the summer, uh, this past summer. Um, to give you a sense of, the, of how much development assistance we're currently providing uh, in, in Sri Lanka, in 2014 and, and 2015, when we have the latest statistics, Canada contributed 27.3 million in international assistance, uh, formed through Global Affairs Canada and Finance Canada. Our bilateral programming focuses on economic development and well-being and social integration for the poorest and most vulnerable. And a lot of that work is in the North. <coughs> through vocational training, agricultural production, and access to credit, and markets for small business. It also promotes post-conflict uh, reconciliation, including the strengthening of land rights. Other global affairs programs are supporting uh, democratization, human rights, and inclusion. And as we look um, to the future, so you know, <coughs> some of you may know that we've just completed an international assistance review. And a key component of that moving forward will be supporting gender equality and women's empowerment. And so when we look at what we want to do in Sri Lanka, we want to make sure that women and girls are part of the progress. Um, I think, um, you know, I, I want to also um, say that um, this gathering provides a unique opportunity and a unique time <laughs> in history to support Sri Lankan development. I've been so impressed by the creativity, the ideas and partnerships and the leadership um, coming from this meeting, but I'm not surprised given the wealth of knowledge and expertise you all bring to the table. And I've certainly benefited from it personally. Economic development and growth and an enabling and stable environment and collaboration by all partners are going to be key as we look to supporting transition needed in Sri Lanka and realizing the hopes of Sri Lankan people in the North and East, Sri Lankan communities abroad, and Sri Lanka publishes everywhere because you do have a global community out there supporting you. So thank you very much and congratulations. <coughs>